Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today we're going to take a look at a gorgeous 1970 Dodge Challenger. This is an RT Tribute, it's not a real car, but I'm telling you guys this car is beautiful. Recent uh, nut and bolt rotisserie restoration. Uh, bought this guy a car from a gentleman that man just a great guy John is just an awesome guy in his I think he's mid 70s uh, hey when I grow up I want to be him I mean just a great guy knows more about or yeah no probably has forgot more about Mopars than I know um, he built the car he builds all of his cars if you remember a couple of years ago I had a, a V code sublime green roadrunner that I bought from him and I'm telling you, this guy knows what he's doing. Uh, but beautiful car, rotisserie restoration, it's body color underneath. It has a healthy 440 six, six pack with a four speed, a pistol grip four speed uh, manual transmission. And uh, matter of fact, this car was featured, I saw him at the Mopar Nats last year um, at Columbus. And I think they, uh, the uh, Mopar Muscle magazine he showed me the article i should have got it from him i completely forgot but uh he was featured in in the magazine in this car i think he was the highest horsepower in a uh, i can't remember guys i don't want to tell you something wrong but great car matter of fact he took jay for a ride test drive before we picked it up from him and uh scared the mess out of scared the mess out of jay pretty good when a 70 year old can get you grabbing for air in a car again it is a tribute car uh, but very nicely done beautiful paint this plum crazy purple it's got the uh, N94 fiberglass hood on it great guy man He, uh, matter of fact, he had it out. He never even got it off the trailer. We bought it from him right on his trailer. Black vinyl tops, all new. You can see the chrome and stainless is excellent. Now listen, if you're not looking for something fast, guys, this car is not the car for you. This car absolutely flies. If you don't know what you're doing, you'll get hurt in this car. This car runs. And again, the underneath is just as nice as the as the top. I was messing with him in Columbus last year, trying to get him to sell me this car, and kept shooing me away. <laughs> pretty pretty car, the laser straight down the sides. It's got BF Goodrich radial TAs all the way around it, 15 inch rallies. You can see he's got the RT rear valance on it. I've got a ton of information on the motor and trans and drivetrain guys, and his phone number will go with it uh, to the guy who buys this car. And he builds them all himself. Great car, man. Beautiful car. It's got some real depth to it. Does have front disc brakes. It's about the only way you'll stop this thing, too. This thing runs, guys. Uh, it's a 72 day coated block. Um, 440, it's a 30 over 440. Uh, it's got a huge camshaft. I do have the cam card for it. Stock um, six pack unit, um, Wisco pistons. Uh, it's got all ARP bolts. It's got a high volume oil pump on it with a Hemi six quart oil pan in it. Um, it's got polished um, 440 source heads in it uh, with all custom springs and it's got uh, six pack rods in it. Again, I've got a ton of information for the motor. I'll make sure I get that in the ad. And detailed out nicely. 
Manual steering does have power disc, or I'm sorry, manual disc brakes on it, electronic ignition. Mopar radiator with the shroud. It's got all TTI headers on it and with, uh, that goes into three inch exhaust. Love this car, man. It's got an AAR hood on it. Get that to focus in, that sunshine behind it. There's the fender tag, but it's not an original car, guys. It is a uh, it is a tribute car. And he did a beautiful job building this car. And like I say, fun to drive, man. You look in there, I mean, all new brake lines. This guy knows how to build a car. I know we sent that V-code to some folks up in Canada, and they love that car. Black vinyl interior. Seats are all new. New carpet. This guy, like I said, he knows how to build a car. Bucket seats. It's got a, um, a billet uh, competition shifter in it. One great thing about this business, I mean, I've been doing it for 25 years, and if you guys know our story, my dad started the place in 78, but the people are cool. Not everybody, but guys like John, they're cool. He's got some aftermarket gauges in there. Uh, you said the radio even works, right, Jay? Yes. Radio does work. Uh, it's showing 52,596. You know, I, I, honestly, I never even asked him on the mileage, guys. I can try to give him a call and, uh, and ask him, but it's a fresh, fresh rotisserie. Uh, again, three-inch dual exhaust. It's got a uh, Dana 60 410 Sure Grip in there. It's got uh, super stock springs in it that have been de-arched so that the car's not all jacked up in the rear end. Uh, frame connectors, he painted those purple. Um, new fuel tank. I can't say enough about it, guys. You want an awesome Challenger, you're going to love this car, man. It's all painted body color in here. You can see everything's new. All the lines are new. And he just really does a beautiful job. Factory jack. No spare in there. That's just a wicked cool car, man. And again, Dana rear end. And it's all body color underneath here, guys. Gorgeous, gorgeous car. I think the thing that saves John is the fact that he does all this stuff himself. If you walked into a restoration shop and tried to recreate this car, it'd probably shock you at what it would cost to build this car. And I have a real appreciation for that, man. When I'm, you know, when I'm talking to people about their cars, man, I, I don't pick their car. I tell people that when I'm looking at it, I like it. So there's no reason for me to pick at it because I know, man, people have put their hearts and souls into these cars. And I know we get people in here and they want to nitpick and do things like that. And I tell them, these cars are not easy to find. And uh, the money that's been put in these cars will baffle most people. This 
star is bad, guys. Nice to see that hood. Fuel gauge works. Looks like he's got both the gauges upper and I know the upper one's working. Park brake works, guys. Listen to this bad boy for. <laughs> Radio works. Blower motor, Jay? Yeah. Blower motor works, guys. Look how nice those doors shot. I'm not a big e-body guy. That was bad right there, guys. Man, this car is tough. Yeah, make, make sure you keep track of our inventory, guys. You can do that at southernmotors.com, or you're always welcome. Pick up the phone. Give us a call, 248-620-3355. Man, I dig that. Oh. If you're watching, brother, I like this one better than the V code. You were right. Look how pretty that car is. This one's straight. Have a great day, guys.